Kevin Lynch, Tom Hanneman back on a Timberwolves fast break following a 93-71 loss for Minnesota in Memphis. A very tough loss. Key factors for the Grizzlies, their bench and their defense, which was overpowering for Minnesota. Andrew Wiggins finally looked human. He had a tough night. Yeah, he did. Uh, for Minnesota, there wasn't a whole lot to get excited about offensively, maybe with the exception of Zach Levine, who finished with 22 points, uh, was four of eight from downtown. He showed some life and some spunk there early on in the third quarter, but uh, for the most part, in some ways, kind of a dead effort by Minnesota in this ball game. And give credit to Memphis. I mean, they're a yep. good defensive team. They like to muck it up and slow it down and grind it out, which they did. And you could tell early on in the ball game, the tone was set. And the, the game was being played at the pace that the Grizzlies like to play, and that was going to spell trouble for Minnesota. Consequently, the Wolves lose by over 20 points. Look at the final numbers tonight. Neither team shot the ball well, both under 40%. Three-point shooting was really awful for the Grizzlies. But in spite of all that, they find a way to win. After it was over, Carl Anthony Towns offered his take on the loss. Yeah, it was uh, something that we had to learn. We we just didn't execute as well as we wanted to. Um, you know, we have to come out with a much better uh, uh, focus than we did tonight. How tough did their defense make it on you? As a team? I mean, it was uh, for us. We had to. We we just we just didn't execute. I think it's more on us than them. It was more that we didn't uh, follow our game plan, follow our plays, and. Uh, we did a little more. Uh, we broke off too many things. Uh, we just had to stick to our game plan. We didn't stay focused there. No rest for the weary. Timberwolves come home. They've got Boston on Monday night, a game that will bring you on the uh, Fox Sports North Plus channel. Wednesday in New Orleans, and that road trip continues at Phoenix and then Golden State next Saturday. Timberwolves have lost 10 consecutive games in Boston, but have won four in a row against the Celtics at Target Center. That trend they'd like to continue. Yeah, it's not going to be easy. This is one of the better teams in the Eastern Conference, as we know, Tom. And uh, that's a team that has aspirations to not just get to the playoffs, but advance. But I think a big challenge will be, can you stay with Isaiah Thomas, who uh, gives a lot of teams problems. But Minnesota has struggled guarding small, quick point guards that can score. And that's exactly what this guy is. So the Wolves got to keep track of him. If they don't, they're going to be in trouble. But if they can, that's a team that uh, the Wolves can beat. Hope you'll join us at 6.30 Monday night for Wolves Live ahead of the Timberwolves battle with Boston.